Live in the Xbox Arena, it's Dead or Alive 4. Fighting for the San Francisco Optics. He's interrupting a heart-to-heart -heart with the ladies for a little hand-to-hand -hand with the men. Cardell Chappelle Thomas. And pressing the attack for the Chicago Chimera. It's a one-man wrecking crew known as Jeremy Black Mamba. Chappelle is competing as Ayane, a devious diva with a good distance game. Ayane is extremely evasive, capable of spinning like a top and then crushing her foe completely. Black Mamba is competing as Helena, whose special stance allows her to avoid all mid and high attacks, while her superb high and low combo string mix-ups can dish out a world of hurt. Black Mamba of the Chicago Chimera definitely needs to put some points on the board here for Chicago. So it is up to him to try to narrow that gap. Of course, Chappelle, very, very beastly competitor from San Francisco Optics. But look at Black Mamba as he starts off with the first big combo of the game using that move that he showed us in the player pro, or the pro player tip as he ducks under his opponent's attack. Now putting together those string combos. Chappelle looks like he's unable to do anything here. Finally gets a couple hits in. One, two, three. Can he put anything together? Jumps over his opponent and regains some positioning. He's trying to bring it back in his favor. Black Mamba only needs one more hit. Dave is, or Chappelle is trying to come back and get it. But the high counter from Black Mamba, and he wins the first round. Take your time. Great round by Black Mamba. He's uh, actually using a different character than they used last time. Last time they met up, Dave Chappelle won 5-0, and now Black Mamba is pretty co consistent with this character, and he wants to try this one this time around. You're absolutely right. Now, on this level, too, you want to watch out for the danger zones, which are the stairs. If you knock your opponent down those stairs, they will take a lot of damage, and you will have the advantage. Both players getting some nice hits off. Black Mamba with the majority of the damage done on Chappelle, but Chappelle equalizes things, and Black Mamba is right back in it putting together a few short and weak hits to get some damage off of Chappelle right here, using that duck once again. And there is the screen combo, Black Mamba. They put those scores on the board for Chicago that they need. That brings them within one point now. Very close game. That's right, Black Mamba up two to zero as we get ready for the third round of this Dead or Live male matchup. Get ready, fight! If Black Mamba wins this one, we will be tied in the overall scores. Chappelle is coming out fighting, though. Definitely putting the pressure on. Black Mamba coming right in. Beautiful job. Sends his opponent down the stairs. Gets that additional damage now. They're only on the first flight. There's another whole flight of stairs that these players can tumble down. And they're going to want to be very, very cautious about being next to those stairs. Chappelle coming back with a nice, nice attack right there. Going to put together this combo. One more hit will do it for Chappelle. But Mamba says no. Gets in a nice combo. Another one right there. Great blocking by Chappelle. But Mamba pulls it off to tie up San Francisco and Chicago. Nice job, Jeremy. Very clutch play by Black Mamba there. That's what, like, that's what you like to see when your team is trying to hunt for that first seed in the playoffs. And we are tied 15 to 15 overall. Get ready. Standing. Chappelle needs to put some rounds on the board. And Black Mamba is going to start things off and not make it easy for a San Francisco opposition. Chappelle, great, great ducking there by Black Mamba. Using his character strength is advantage. Chappelle comes right back. Doesn't quite equalize things, but gets a big combo. It's going to put a big throw out there. We're about equal. Puts another one up on the board. And let's see if he can finish it off with a nice combo. As we do have Black Mamba throwing out as many strikes as he can. There he's going to get a launch. Does he finish it? No. Yes, he does. With the high kick, it's 4 and oh. At one point, Chappelle beat Black Mamba 5-0. Is this finally Black Mamba's ultimate payback? It just seems like Dave Chappelle's really off his game right now, but yeah, it's definitely a payback from the previous 5-0 that Dave Chappelle did on Black Mamba. 
The San Francisco Optic side is rallying for Chappelle to put something together, but that's not stopping Black Mamba from putting a world of hurt here in Dead or Alive for Mail on his opponent, coming out once again, and it looks like Chappelle just having a real tough time with those combos that Black Mamba is putting out there. Nice job there by Black Mamba once again. This could be game winning point. Nice, nice hits by, Gabe, uh, by Chappelle. He's gonna get one more. Black Mamba could finish it right here. And there it is, the throw. Unbelievable. Black Mamba gets his revenge and 5 0s Chappelle in dead or alive for male. Tough match. That's the first time Davis Pell's ever been 5 0 period. And Black Mamba's been 5 0 twice, but that's going to feel great to come back from the previous beating earlier this season. It was fantastic. Let's take a